what people call Chirac, which is actually our uh, murder rate is going down by 20% every year. I just talked to the superintendent, met with Michael Sachs, that's Ron, Ron's uh, right-hand man. So uh, I think it's the bravery that helps you beat this game called life. You know, they tried to scare me to not wear this hat, my own friends, but this hat, it gives me, it gives me power in a way. You know, my dad and my mom separated, so I didn't have a lot of male energy in my home. And also, uh, I'm married to a family that, um, you know, <laughs> not a lot of male energy going on. It's beautiful, though. But there's times where, you know, it's something about, you know, I love Hillary, I love everyone, right? But the campaign, I'm with her, just didn't make me feel as a guy that didn't get to see my dad all the time, like a guy that could play catch with his son. Stop right it there. It was something about when I put this hat on. and maybe Stop right there. All right, so here's the deal. He talked about, of course, uh, what drove uh, the prison population was uh, the mental health cuts that took place in the 80s and 90s. You notice Kanye West made no mention of the devastating impact of crack uh, cocaine and how there was a disparity between crack cocaine and powder cocaine. So if you were white, you use powder cocaine. That was a 100 to 1 difference between the ratio of if you use crack cocaine to powder cocaine. That what drove the criminal justice system. But here's what Kanye West did not say. He talked about the cuts to mental health. Who made those cuts? Ronald Wilson Reagan. Those were the massive cuts that were made between 1980 and 1988. So if you're going to make that particular point, then you must do so. What then happened was the cuts took place on the federal level, which then trickled, which then trickled down to the state level and then down to the county and city levels. And so you had folks who then said mental illness, we don't care about that. We're going to have drastic cuts. It was Republican Ronald Reagan who drove that. It's very easy to Google. Something else Kanye did not mention.